What's up, YouTube? Crispy Coil. Got a Grail video. First of all, I want to say uh, thank you to Throwback King. Uh, I sent him a link to this uh, off eBay to this jersey to make sure it was legit. Uh, he got back real quick. Um, I want to say thanks a lot. Uh, first of all, I'm from Philadelphia. Um, Allen Iverson is my favorite player, like, ever. And uh, this jersey right here is real special because um, this is when Allen, like, took over Philadelphia. Uh, around the city at that time, it was in every paper. Allen was, like, the truth. He was the number one thing in the city. He brought people tourist money. Allen was the shit at this point in my life. In everybody's life in Philly. And uh, in a game... Jordan and him, they put, they play like an isolation play, and uh, Allen crossed him over a couple times and hit a jump shot, and the crowd went crazy, and it was like Allen, like his main, you know, it was like crazy here, man, when he did that, it was like, you know, Allen is here, man, he's, he's no joke, in Georgetown, he wore the, nothing beats when, when AI wore the, the, the patent leather Concord 11s and with the Georgetown jersey, oh my god, man. With the Braves, Allen was just everything that was that was fresh about basketball at that point. Anyway, this is the jersey. It's Mitchell and Ness. Uh, retail, three hundred bucks. Hardwood classic. Jock tag, nineteen ninety six, ninety seven. Triple stitched letters. You got double stitch on the uh, the numbers. Can't really see that. You got the gold NBA tag right here at the top. Um, I can't explain to you how much I, I love this jersey. I would love to get uh, the red one, but uh, for right now, this is this is cool with me. Uh, on the back, you got the Iverson single stitch, blue letter, double stitch number three. Sixers are playing real well right now, which is kind of crazy. Iguodala, you know. Anyway, that's the jersey, man. I I never thought I'd, I'd find one of these, um, and I, I can't believe I did. And it's crazy that the person that sold this is from my old neighborhood in Philadelphia. So uh, the shipping was fairly cheap. It was actually, I think it was actually free. Um, but, yeah, it just came today. So, uh, throwback came man. Thanks a lot, man. I, I really appreciate the info. Um, made buying this a lot easier because I, I hate thinking I might get ripped off. So, yeah, definitely good looks. Anyway, I don't just like showing a jersey. I got a shoe here that, uh, I would like to show. This is a countdown pack shoe. It is the five. I figured this was fitting. This is one of my favorite shoes of all time. Now we're doing since we're doing grails, let's do grails. I remember the first time I saw this shoe as a kid. I was picking up my papers. I used to deliver this paper called uh, the News Gleaner. And, uh, or the Daily News, I'm sorry, I think I was delivering the Daily News at that time, and I was picking up my papers at this dude's crib, uh, throwing the, it on my bike, and, uh, his older brother came out, and I seen the reflector tongue pop off with the sun, and I was just, like, stuck, I was completely stuck, he got black inside on the air bubble, he got the 2-3 right there, red with the black silhouette, you got the iconic mesh right there, you got the red, uh, the red toggle right there, the lock. You got that 3M vicious tongue, which makes your shoe so iconic on the back. You got the Air Jordan. You got the Countdown Pack patch. Jump man, I wish it said Nike Air right there. Wouldn't that be crazy, people? Oh my god. Anyway, um, they do not come with these laces. These are like the Freddy Krueger speckle joints or something. <laughs> But uh, I think it looks fresh with those laces. I always, I always try to switch laces out with, with all my sneakers. Um, I just like it. Uh, I don't know. I just like to add something to a shoe. But um, I think the shoe goes pretty, pretty nice with that jersey right there. And I guess you could just throw that in the mix. 
That's what I was just wearing. So, uh, all right, everybody. Just wanted to throw this little video up there. I, I, I'm just so happy right now with this jersey. I'm trying to get into the jersey game. And, uh, yeah, there it is. My first Mitchell and Ness jersey. I'm so happy. Crazy happy right now. And uh, everybody out there in the, in the shoe game, keep doing your thing. I'm not going to stop buying shoes. I never will. But uh, I'm going to take a little hiatus and only cop, you know, a couple things. But uh, I'm going to get the playoff 13s, of course. Yeah, I mean, try to get a playoff LeBron if, or uh, an all-star LeBron. But uh, that's it, people. Everybody out there in, uh, in YouTubeville. Uh, and shout out to um, Young Dr. Seuss. Uh, dude always has crazy shoes. He just pulled out a premier pair of 23s. One of my favorite shoes of all time, man. Sick, sick shoe. Um, off the top of my head, uh, I was just watching that video. Sand Chisel, uh, 23. Uh, dude still always has real dope videos. Um, you know the usual suspects on YouTube, people. But uh, that's off the top of my head right now. Everybody else, keep doing your thing. Thanks for watching. Please rate, subscribe, comment. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alan Iverson. Shit. All right. Thanks, people. Peace.